During the Cold War, the Soviet Union invested heavily in its air defense systems. As a result, Russia now possesses some of the most advanced air and missile defense systems in the world, and many countries around the globe use them. It would be interesting to examine some of these AD systems, their origin, and their evolution over the last half century. The S-500 is a mobile SAM, ABM designed to counter aircraft, ballistic, and cruise missiles and reportedly can target low-orbit satellites. It supplements the S-400 and the A-235 ABM missile systems. Russia began developing the S-500 in 2010, shortly after deploying the S-400 in 2007. It has been in service with the Russian Space Forces since September 2021. Russia claims that the S-500 can intercept all types of modern hypersonic weapons and has claimed to have successfully tested such capability. The final planned range is 600 km for ABM and 500 km for air defense. The S-500 was envisaged to detect and simultaneously engage up to 10 ballistic hypersonic targets flying at a maximum of 7 km seconds. The altitude of a target engaged is claimed to be as high as 180 to 200 kilometers. Its claimed response time is less than 4 seconds, compared to the S-400's around 10. Russia has ordered 10 S-500 battalions to gradually replace the S-300 systems. The first under-development unit was deployed around Moscow in October 2021. In June 2024, Ukraine claimed the S-500 had been deployed to the Crimean Peninsula to defend the Kerch Bridge. Production variants will be deployed in Moscow and the country's central area in 2025. A naval version is the likely armament for the new leader-class destroyers. In recent tests, the S-500 was able to hit a target 482 kilometers away, 80 kilometers further than the previous record. In July 2021, the Russian mod released the first public footage of a live fire test of the new S-500 ABM system at Kapustin Yar. The cost for one S-500 system was estimated to be around $700 to $800 million in 2020 and up to $2.5 billion in 2023. The S-500 Prometheus is a Russian surface-to-air missile, anti-ballistic missile system that supplements the S-400 and the A-235 ABM missile systems. This air defense system is a cutting-edge advancement in Russian military technology designed to address the evolving threats posed by modern aerial warfare. It is a theater ballistic missile defense system. Like its predecessors, the S-500's adaptability is its core feature. The system can launch various types of missiles tailored to specific threats and operational requirements, enhancing its versatility and efficacy in countering evolving airborne dangers. The S-500's radar and targeting systems are among the most advanced in the world, providing engagement ranges of up to 600 kilometers. One of its most notable features is its ability to engage a wide variety of targets, including stealth aircraft, hypersonic missiles, and low-orbit satellites, significantly enhancing Russia's defensive posture.
The sophisticated radar complex consists of four radar vehicles per battery. These include the 91N6E MS band acquisition radar, the 96L6 TSPC band acquisition radar, the 76T6 multi-mode engagement radar, and the 77T6 anti-ballistic missile engagement radar. By using multiple radar frequencies and sophisticated signal processing, the S-500 can identify and track stealth aircraft, reducing their effectiveness in penetrating defended airspace. Thus, the S-500 poses a potential threat to American F-22 Raptor and F-35 stealth fighter aircraft. The system can engage 10 targets simultaneously and has a response time of 3 to 4 seconds, shorter than the S-400. The more powerful jam-proof radar can detect, near space, targets. These cutting-edge radar systems enable the S-500 to detect both ballistic and airborne targets at remarkable distances, with capabilities extending up to 2,000 km for ballistic targets and 800 km for airborne threats. The system is claimed to be highly resilient to electronic interference and can ensure effectiveness even in the face of sophisticated electronic warfare attacks. On paper, an S-500 battery includes three radars, two of which are identical to the radars that Q and S-400. The third radar, the 77T6ABM engagement radar, is optimized for detecting fast-moving ballistic missiles and rockets. The 77N6 was originally meant to be a hit-to-kill missile which is without a warhead. It destroys its target by literally running into it. By removing the warhead, the missile becomes lighter, more maneuverable, and more accurate. Details of the system are still shrouded in mystery. The Kremlin claims that the S-500 is the sole weapon capable of intercepting Russia's air-launched Kinzhal hypersonic, ballistic missile. Russian reports indicate that the S-500 successfully tracked and intercepted hypersonic targets in early 2024. The S-500 system may be delivered in two separate AD complexes, the Long Range Air Defense Missile System and the Anti-Missile Defense Complex. The timeline for S-400 system operationalization has kept getting extended. The S-500 has been in development for more than a decade. Full-scale deployments are currently planned for 2025. As per the original plan, 10 S-500 battalions were to be purchased for the Russian aerospace defense. The series production is around five years behind schedule. A naval version is the likely, 